If you've never added a comment in a document or spreadsheet or presentation that someone has shared with you in Google, it's very easy to do and I'm going to show you a couple different ways that you can go ahead and give feedback to students. You can also um, use this tool if you're working with other teachers like in your PLC or um, a committee or something like that and you want to give feedback to them. So um, it's very simple. So I have a document someone has shared with me and I'm reading through it and I want to give some feedback here. So I'm going to highlight where I want to give feedback and there's two ways that you can add a comment. There's a comment button like right here. If you don't see that button there, that means that the person who has created the document has not given you permission to comment or edit and it's in view only. So uh, you're not able to give feedback directly into the document. But if you do have this, then when you go ahead and click on it, you can also see you can click on it or you could use the shortcut control alt m and that'll open it up and so i can write my feedback here and when i click comment it's going to be there so um another person who sh who has share privileges on the document can go ahead and click this and reply to that. They can also resolve it, meaning it just kind of gets, um, it removes it from, from view right there. <clears throat> the other way that you can um, go ahead and comment, and I'm just going to delete this one because I'm just going to do it again, is I want to give feedback here. So I'm going to click or click on this comments button up here. And so this keeps a list of all the comments that have already occurred on this document. And you can see that this big check mark means that it's been resolved, but it's still here. So you can always go back to see what kind of feedback you've given um, or if you've missed something. But you can also click comment here. That's the second place. And you can go ahead and do that. The other way that you can comment, say that there's multiple collaborators on here, and I want it to give this feedback to someone very specific. If I do the plus sign, I can start to write in that person's um, email address. And if it's someone that you um, work with a lot or you've emailed a lot, their, their names are going to come up here. Um, if it's not, you'd have to type in their whole email. But what that does is that actually sends an email notification to that person saying, hey, someone has given you very specific comments. So if, um, if you're giving feedback and you just want one person to really um, reply to that, you can use the plus feature um, or it could just be a general comment.